White House in Washington comes the final verdict on the fateful tragedy which engulfed the nation 10 months ago. U.S. Chief Justice Earl Warren is the bearer of the sad epilogue. The report on the assassination of President John Fitzgerald Kennedy, compiled by the commission created by President Johnson, which was headed by the Chief Justice himself. is the official conclusion of the events surrounding this Dallas, Texas day. A day that started in a holiday atmosphere, induced by the visit of a young president and his beautiful wife. A day of love and ovations. But three quick shots shattered this day, November 22nd, 1963. Memorial Hospital, President Kennedy died. The fourth U.S. president to perish at the hand of an assassin. To a stunned people, it was unbelievable. The Dallas police arrested Lee Harvey Oswald. They found the assassin's weapon, and they were convinced they had the criminal. But then, a bizarre murder thwarted forever the normal process of justice and the hope of certainty. Jack Ruby, a Dallas nightclub owner, with a nationwide TV audience watching, dealt out his own neurotic justice. Today, the Warren Report attempts to unravel the dark twists into which the national tragedy was thrown, and bookstores the world over are besieged. But quiet reigns at the martyred president's grave, where a solemn procession of warriors forever passes. This nation will never forget.